What's going on, my brothers and sisters? It's your boy, Mini. You know what's interesting to me? I woke up this morning to some DMs from a, 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 guy, that, a guy that I know. A white, a white fella, a lovely white fella that I know. Um, and he, what he had done, he had screenshotted, screenshotted a load of screenshots from another person that I know as well in comment sections and stuff. And it was this person, he, he's his friend, you know? He was like, you know, and it's, it's nothing but racism. This guy that he screenshot, he was arguing bare racism against white people, against Asian people. Um, you know what I mean? Being really, really, I can't say, yeah, being pro-black, but at the same time, being racist. You know what I mean? Creating a lot of division. And the guy left the voice note. He said, look, Min, man, I, I don't know, see this fella here that's doing this. He said, I fucking know him. I grew up with him. Like, I thought he was my mate. He said, I thought he was my mate. He's like, look, I don't understand. Every time you go online, he's online, like, he's being racist and stuff. And what my point is here now, yeah, is... You see these guys when you start, like, playing the, the division game and start... Even if you start saying stuff like, oh, look, you see, white people, we shouldn't let them do our music and even Indian people, we shouldn't let them do our stuff because they wouldn't let us do... They wouldn't let us do it. And you start saying that and you, you start using that and you, you start writing loads of... Um, essays on the wall do you think you just go invisible while you're doing this while you're going on this red this this racist sort of rant saying that white people shouldn't be should be allowed to do certain things asian people because asian people have a problem with us white people have a problem when you go on this sort of racist rant do you really think that your white friends disappear your asian friends disappear and they can't see or hear what you're doing you gotta be a bit more you know you know, and and and, and with, with with the other situation yesterday, like I think it's come to the light now. There was a bit of clickbait. They said it was a clickbait. Um, they say Spray was using clickbait, but you know what? That's two thousand and twenty-four hustling. This, this, this is just how it goes. It's how you, you know what I mean? This is how you hustle. You know, so that man is just show to me. This is man is a master of um, PR and getting his shit out there. He's, he's become a master. But what I'm saying is, now it's come to the light. You can't. You can't blame Spray for the racism that came out of your mouth in comment sections. That's all down to you. It's all down to you. I'm telling you. It's all down to you. Because at no at no point can another man like using tactics here yeah, to, to build his thing bring racism out of me. If it can bring racism out of you, then there must have been racism in you in, in the first place. So let's stop trying to ah, oh, you know what is ah oh, just apologize. And understand, you know what it is, yeah? We're 2024. White people are not going to take over our music. They're not going to do it. You know what I mean? It's like, it's our sound. It's like, we dictate in hip-hop what is the thing. You know what I mean? They can take part in it and be good at it. And they, they might have a few great, like, think about it. <clears throat> We're so scared that they're taking over hip-hop. Why are we going to take over hip-hop? But let me show you something, though. Since Eminem came out, there's only been one Eminem. <clears throat> Like Emin and, and 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 this is how you know Eminem is not where he is because he's white. He's he's is where he is because he is a great rapper, and at a time he was out doing a lot of black rappers. He was very very. I was listening to him. I remember when I first heard him. My name is my name. I'm thinking what the fuck is this? Is cold. Who is this? I've never heard this style before. It was a new style. It was nothing to do with race. Nothing to do with race. And then we saw him, it's like, oh my God, he's a white guy. But I already thought it was cold before I knew what colour he was. You know, so, we can't, because the thing is, we, we, I know it's with us black people. <clears throat> we like to, um, <clears throat> we like to benefit from the sales when white people buy our music and we're getting platinum, we're selling, you know what I mean? We're selling that arenas and stuff because white people's buying up all the tickets. We like to benefit from it and it's not a problem. But then when they want to, have a go because they want to have a go at something that they love, they're passionate about, then we don't want them to do it because it's our thing. And then our angle is, no, 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 but we're not allowed to do your stuff. Why are you taking all our stuff? But no, 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 no. Like, if it was really a problem, if the white man was to say, look, we ain't buying no more black music. So no more, all these black drill artists, we're not buying none of their merch. We're not buying none of their music. We're not spending, we're not, we're not spending a dime. And the Asian people also do the same. We're not spending a dime. You you will realize what's going on, and your black brothers ain't trying to buy your shit because most of the time, the black man thinks he's cooler than the artist. Like, 
my buy and say, what, what the fuck am I buying this guy from up the road for? Like, I'm, my, I'm, my cousin's better than him. I'm better than him. More time, the black man's trying to be that person himself. So he certainly ain't gonna waste his money making you go platinum. So when you think about all those sales and that money, where you think it's really, really coming from? If you've done your research, them white boys, them Asian boys, they be spending a lot of money. They be spending a lot of money and that money be benefiting the black people. So if they want to jump in and have a go, like, let them have a go. Sorry about that, guys. My daughter's making up bear noise. I think stop working. I've got to just press this little button here. Yeah, let them have a go, man. But let's stop making excuses, innit? Like, if you've got, like, issues, racism issues, just say so, innit? Just say. Like, I was watching Jedi, Jedi's thing. Shout out to my brother, brother Jedi. And he says something which is real. A lot of people, black brothers out there, they just don't like seeing a white guy doing black music. I don't, and, and women, I don't want to see it. They just don't want to see it. They got issues. They got their own issues. And what it is, is they're waiting for the smallest little thing to use that as an example. You see, that's why we shouldn't support. No, we can't, we have, can't have them stealing our culture, but they had issues before. You got, your own, you got issues. You really, really got issues. But in 2024, me, I'm all about sharing, caring. I'm not, I'm not insecure enough to believe that a white person could steal our thing. <coughs> Because we set, you know what I mean? We set the, when it comes to the pace of the music that we're rapping to, when it comes to the sound, when the sound changes, that's not down to them in our culture. That's down to us. We decide on that. We don't like, that's not fashionable no more. This is fashionable. Oh, we don't like House and Gary's no more. Let's go to Drill. We, let's go to Grime. That's a, that's, that's a black man making them choices. That's not because it's our culture. It's our culture. Okay, it's time to, that, that Vibes card, Cartel song is the best. That's black people. And then the white guy might think, raw. And you know what? That is hard. Do you know what I'm trying to say? But it's like, it's our, it's our, it's, it's like if I'm listening to an Asian song, I can't tell an Asian man what the best song. I'm going to change the sound of Asian music. I, it's impossible. I can join in and have a go and actually sing it and they might feel, right, this guy is actually singing it better than us. But I can't start changing the whole shit. It won't sound right. They'll be like, hello, I'll be change, I might be changing it to something that's not fashionable. You know, so stop being so insecure, man. Stop being racist. Stop trying to blame Young's brain now. I use a click blame. Just apologize. If you said anything racist about the man, just apologize, man. Shouts out to Jedi. I see that video there. But you got these to just slow down a little bit. And like, it's 2024. Remember that shit there. It's 2024. And if the white man was to take back all their money from the record, the money that they spend on these artists, these black artists, a lot of black artists will be forbidden. They have to come back to the street. <laughs> I'm telling you, we ain't trying to put no money in their pocket. I can't remember the last black person CD I bought. I ain't fucking buying no music. This is the black mentality. We don't really buy shit. We don't really buy. We don't really be, be really be buying shit. Them white people, them same white people that you're you're trying to shoot down. Them motherfuckers be be spending their money on use lot. Just shut the fuck up, man. Back they back, back, back they they're not allowed to rap. Back they're not allowed to do re reggae. We can't. How many? Look, how many? Look how many reggae artists are out there. Black man reggae artists. How many of them? My daughter just turned the light off. She went mad. I I I. You can't be. What are you doing? Messing up the settings. Let me turn this turn this shit back on again. Wait there. Leave, leave that one there. Yeah. How many successful white reggae artists, bashman artists, DJs, whatever you want to call them, can you name? I can name our with black black artists. I can name. I can go on for days. Huh? Name me twenty successful white Jamaican DJs that are smashing things right now. You can't. Name me ten. You can't. So let's not make it seem like they're stealing our culture and they're taking over. We they they're running away. They're not. They they're just really not. So shut up. M dot R is just M right now it's M dot R. On his own. He might have Tug of War, a few others. But they're not exactly flipping blowing up right now, like the biggest things going, making a lot of money, are they? Like, come on, let's stop acting like they're stealing the culture and winning and running away with it and we're not gonna have it no more. They're stripping us. Stop talking shit. You know, I thought I'd leave that video with you this morning. It's a new new week. I didn't even blog last week, so I had to hit you up at the end of the week. You know, shout out to you for paying attention. You know what we do? It's your boy Mini. Peace.